Are you going on a Western Caribbean cruise or on Royal Caribbean's Harmony of the Seas? If so, this series of Let's Cruise videos is for you. In this episode, I find myself on the island of Cozumel and a day at sea coming back to Galveston. Let's go. Welcome to day six. Today I'm in Cozumel, Mexico, and I'm going to a professional wrestling match. <laughs> I know, but I wanted to try something that was really out there, and that was the most out there thing I could find. I, I get free tequila or margaritas, I think, and tacos, and I think I get to meet the professional wrestlers. Anyhow, it's 7 o'clock, 7.30, and I got to get out of the cabin for the, the cabin steward, so time for some coffee. <laughs> Let's see how this goes today. Let's go. Here's a little, just a little hack that you can use for specialty dining here on Royal Caribbean. If you see any of the waiters or waitresses walking around like the Royal Promenade or Central Park or Boardwalk with a menu, just walking around, it's because they haven't filled their seats and they're trying to do that. And They'll give you a discount and maybe even some extra bonuses. So yesterday, day before, day before yesterday, I was on the Royal Promenade and I was just walking and the other direction, waiter was coming and he had a menu in his hand. I walked by him, saw the menu, turned around and said, what restaurant are you selling? And he said, 150 Central Park. I said, great. Let's hear it. 
and he said, I'll give you, I think it was $20 off and lobster. Anyway, he said, uh, so Kat's from Canada and we have lobster frequently. So that wasn't too much of an enticement, but 20 bucks off is, and I said, great, sign me up. Welcome to day seven, or also known as the last real day of the cruise. And uh, today's loaded. To start things off, I'm going to Taste of Royal. Never been to it before. I, <laughs> yeah, I don't know why it's taken me so long, but actually I do because Almost always, this is held at the same time as the sushi and sake pairing, which I go to all the time. Anyhow, it's in 150 Central Park, and basically they take uh, dishes from several of the specialty dining restaurants and serve them to you. Sell out beneath the sky so grand with naught but hope held in their hand Eyes reflecting the celestial dome They wander far but dream of home Wind in their hair with every step they carve A tale of to the wide world to marvel Sun. Travelers without a map to run Their compass pointed to the stars They pick their way through life's memoirs Days that whisper, nights that scream I just got back from Taste of Royal And why am I sitting in the bed instead of out having fun? because it was so good that I decided to do a review video immediately after it. Never done that before. Yeah, I found my replacement for the chef's table because it was out absolutely outstanding. Keep in mind, this was a five course meal and it had a glass of wine with each course and it started with like a champagne thing. I have the uh, tropical drink tasting at three and then at four i have a wine tasting i had no idea they were all like back to back when i booked them this should be uh entertaining sailing on the open sea is wind in my hair cruising on a ship of dreams going anywhere strumming my guitar under the moonlight, singing sweet melodies all through the night. Drinking in the ocean sights, waves crashing at the bow. With every note I strum, my spirit starts to grow. Serenading the stars above, a lullaby to see lost in the gentle rhythm this moment's all i need oh sailing on the breeze my worries drift away to the rhythm of the waves as they gently sway As the moon shines bright So you paint a picture of a face A face that was in Changed, you stayed the same. But if you did, I 
tastings I can still stand now the second tasting I kept saying no more no more because they're giving us everyone that was there shots oh my goodness I want to go to bed and it's not that late it's like six o'clock and uh, I have chops right now as I mentioned before so time to go down and uh, I hope it's better than it's been in the past Let's go. Walking down the stairs with your eyes closed is not a good idea. And by the way, they are stairs on a cruise ship. They would be called ladders on a naval ship, but these are called stairs because it's a cruise ship. Okay, time for a rant. What is wrong with people? Seriously, the entire Chops restaurant was packed and I really tried to give it the benefit of the doubt. And I ordered, let's see, I had shrimp cocktail. It's shrimp, you can't mess that up. I mean, my goodness, you take it out of a bag, you put it on a plate. Caesar salad, you can't mess that up either. For my main course, I got a rack of lamb. It was disgusting. It was tough. It was grizzly. It was, yeah, seriously, you can go to Costco and buy lamb and cook it in your own oven and make better lamb than what Chops made. For sides, I got French fries and mac and cheese. The French fries were supposed to be truffled French fries. They were soggy fries with salt and the mac and cheese wasn't cooked correctly. Now, okay, I might sound like some sort of uh, food snob, I'm not. I have had the privilege of eating at some very good restaurants, but seriously, how can you screw up mac and cheese? And then the dessert was apple pie, which was, which was good. So what's the lesson from all this? If you're not gonna have filet mignon, don't go to Chops. Okay, send the hate comments. <laughs> I'm sorry. Maybe it's just my taste buds. They're not refined. We've already established that on the Alaska cruise. <clears throat> yeah, anyhow. <sighs> I need to calm down. Time to go sit on the bed for a bit. What a great end to an amazing cruise. Well, except for that little bit at the end. If you enjoyed this series of Let's Cruise videos, why not watch this series that focuses on the ratings of the seas in Alaska. See you next time. Don't forget to subscribe.